Hey guys, Rose Rapper there, and today I'm going to show you how you can install Tubi on a Chromecast Google TV from anywhere in the world. So say if you're in a location where Tubi is not currently available, then this should work for you. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be sideloading Tubi onto the Chromecast, and then we're going to be using a VPN to make it look as though we're in a location where Tubi is currently available. So for this, we're going to need some sort of downloader to download the Tubi APK, and you're going to need some sort of VPN. So first things first is we need to download an app that we can use to then download the APK for Tubi. So the first thing we need to do is we need to open up the Play Store. So if I just hold down the Voice Assistant button, and I ask it, open Play Store. Opening Google Play Store. It will then open the Play Store. And as you can see, it shows up Tubi here for me as it's already on my network on another device. But for you, it likely will not show up in the Play Store. So what we're going to do is we're going to come to search, and we're going to search for a F T V news space downloader. And then we're going to install the downloader by AFTV news. And then we will open the app up. Then we will allow it access to our storage and we will press OK. Now we will come to the URL bar here and we will type to be space A P K. And then we will press enter. And that will then search that on Google. Now if when you search, if for some reason it doesn't actually search and you just have a blank page, just come to the top and change the URL to www.google.co.uk and then search as you normally would on Google. So now in our search results, we're going to come down and we're going to find a download link. So I'm going to choose the APK PO one and then I will press on download APK. Then I will scroll down and then I'll press the download APK button again, and it will start downloading the APK for Tubi. And now that has downloaded, it now comes up asking us to adjust our settings so that we can install unknown apps. So if I press on settings, and then we find the download in the list of apps, and we change it to allowed, it will now come up asking us, do we want to install this app? So we're going to click install on Tubi, and it will now start installing Tubi. So I'll just press done on that, and I will come back home. So now if we come across to our apps, as you can see, we now have Tubi installed. So at the minute, if we open it up, as you can see, it currently doesn't work. Now that is because it detects that we're in a location where Tubi is not currently available. And that is why we need to use a VPN to make it think we are in a location where Tubi is available. So if I now come back to home, and again, if I ask Google Assistant to open up the Play Store, open up Play Store. Opening Google Play Store. And now you want to install whichever VPN you use. I'm going to be using PIA. There will be a referral link in the description. If you want to sign up through that, it will give you a better deal. But it doesn't have to be PIA. It can be any other VPN that you use. So I'm going to install PIA. And now it's installed if I open it up. Now I will just sign into my account. Again, if you are setting up a new subscription, then please consider using the referral link. So I'll just log in, and now I've signed in, I will just allow PIA to monitor the network traffic. So if we press down and then come across to OK, that will then allow the VPN to work. So now in your VPN, you then need to find a location where Tubi is currently available. So I'm just going to come to the USA, and I will select USA Streaming Optimized. So now we've connected to the VPN in the USA, if we now come back to home, and we now try and open Tubi up, and we press retry. As you can see, it now loads up. So I'll just show you that it does play videos. And there we go, as you can see, it is now working. So guys, that's going to be it for this video. If you liked it, don't forget the like button. If you decide to hit the dislike button, subscribe for more content like this, and I'll see you another time. Bye.